Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Hey. Elizabeth. I'm here, I'm here. Oh, you look so happy. I've got good news for you. Okay, okay, come on, tell me about it. Alright, sit. Sit. Tell me about it. I was with Dr. Alex. And Dr. Alex told me I can regain my sight. And I can see again. As a matter of fact, we have already fixed an appointment for the eye procedure. What? Yes. Yes. What is it? Wait. Am I not a part of this relationship? Of course you are. So why are you making decisions without involving me? What decision are you talking about? without involving me. Don't I have a say in this relationship? Hey, what are you talking about? This is for me and you. It is for you, it's not for me. It is for us. No! You're supposed to let me know before you make a decision like this. Not you and Miss Dr. Alex. What are you saying? I am saying you're not supposed to see me. I'm supposed to see you for the first time in my life. I don't want you to. Why? Why? What? What's going on? What is wrong? I just, I just, you're just making me feel like I'm, I'm, I'm just, just a furniture in this house. You, you just go ahead and you make decisions without even telling me. Please calm down. I'm calm. You're shouting. I haven't seen or heard you react in this manner. What is happening? What is happening? Talk to me. You're not supposed to see me. I want to see you. I just, I don't know. I'm so free. Come on. What is wrong? This is very. So, just, I'm just, I'm just, I just don't want to lose you. I just want to lose me. You want to lose me? You're not going to lose me. What is going on? Talk to me. No, I don't want. There's something I've been meaning to tell you. I, don't, I just didn't know how to say it. Talk to me. Is this? There was one time. One time. I had an accident. <laughs> me in this condition why wouldn't I love you in your own condition uh, this is really bad that's why I've just just wanted to keep it to myself 
If you see me, then I just wanted you to just, just, uh, uh, please, uh, since then no man has ever looked at me, that's why I don't want you to see me. And then all my friends, all my friends got married and left and... Abandon you after all these years. Trust me. No. I'm so scared. I just want to see your face. I'm so scared. <laughs> I, come I on. just want to have you in my life. You have me. I need you to be strong. Oh, no. Come on, man. Come on. I don't want. Mr. Eric, everything will be all right, okay? Okay. I am very sure that after the procedure, you will regain your sight. Don't worry too much. Good afternoon, Dr. Kate. How is everything going? Very well, Doctor. Everything is set. Mr. Eric. Dr. Alex. The D-Day has finally come, all right? You are about to be moved to the theater. Are you ready? Yes. Yes, I'm ready. <laughs> Dr. Kate, let's do it. Why are you crying? Can you see me? What happened? Baby, why are you crying? Eric, I was told you wouldn't move to theater and you requested to see me. Is anything the matter? Doctor, 
I don't think I can do this anymore. I, I don't understand. This is what you've always wanted. Your sight. Yes. I've always wanted my sight. But my fiancé, Elizabeth is so scared. She's scared that I'm going to leave her if I see her. Doctor, I don't want to lose the woman that has been there for me all this while. Doctor, please, I'm sorry. I don't want to do this anymore. understand. Oh my God. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Come on here. I'm so sorry. I just, I'm so, so scared. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> 